Yeah, so this is oxygen bar tank. Work with that uh, mask. This is our lifeline on the mountain. Without this, we cannot climb the mountain. We're not there, like those people without oxygen, you know, we need oxygen on the mountain. So let me shut this down a little bit. So, uh, so this is like a generally this is a mask, right? And this is like a, this part is a mixer that makes uh, oxygen that flow from the tank to here, mixed with the uh, the, uh, the 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 breath that you have, so that we the, it become more natural the air that you can breathe. This is the exhale part. Okay, this side, uh, I I think it's just uh, the design. So. Okay. Maybe it's an, an overflow of or when you know something stuck or something like that. And then you have a strap. Okay, strap on your head, tight, and also over here so that you don't you know it doesn't slip out. And you don't want it to slip out because outside air uh, and oxygen can leak out. The outside air can get in, in right. And this is important. You kind of have to pay attention to this one. Oh. Uh, depends on the flow that you are using. Yes, yes. Uh, but this one can tell you how much oxygen left in the tank. Okay. This are uh, the spring that can uh, give you the pressure. Th that's why it's transparent. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And then uh, this one will connect to the regulator uh, on the tank. And then on the regulator, you can uh, adjust the uh, the flow of oxygen. For example, um, you can go half a flow or one or two or three whatever depends okay. on what you need yeah so that's basically it okay. you have any questions okay. no? uh, how to breathe oh you just have to breathe normally just like uh, using your nose and of course sometimes you want to you know breathe by mouth you can do yes, that yes, too yes. but uh, just breathe normally exhale normally okay. and it will come out naturally so okay. don't worry but sometimes, uh, you know, when you breathe so hard, okay. the, the breath can kind of leak out this side. Okay. So, uh, just have to be, be aware, well, I mean, if you make it tight, so it, it should be okay. Yeah. And uh, when to start O2? Uh, uh, when we start O2, uh, usually uh, uh, you start on Camp 3. When you get to Camp 3 oh. you, uh, for the day, you oh. just rest and everything, but only that night you start to use oxygen. Like uh, you can use half a flow or sometimes one. When, when, when we sleep? Yeah, only when you sleep. Okay. And then from then on, you use oxygen oh. all the way. I think uh, we, we step up, increase, increase up step by step. Yes, exactly. Okay. But uh, to sleep, you, you tend to go lower flow, oh, lower flow. Because you don't need that much to sleep, oh. right? But oh. you're not, oh. act, uh, you don't have any activity. Oh. But uh, when you start to walk, uh, to, high, uh, to, to climb, uh, you definitely have to increase a little bit. Uh, depends on what your body needs and how much oxygen in total did you have, right? So you have to do that uh, calculation to uh, to make sure you have enough and you know to, to climb the mountain. So that's what it is. Thank you very much. Let's see. Okay. Namaste. Yeah. Namaste.